Hello world and welcome to Channel Bill. Just took my dog for a walk and uh, on the track I came across this. Hope you can see it. I can try and get it a bit into focus. I think that is. Anyway, what it is, it's a, a token and it is marked Super Token with uh, a picture of a jester. Looks like a um, a copper alloy thing and this got me to thinking about cleaning so what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up uh, a little thing and we're going to clean this coin using uh, electrolysis simple enough process and I'll tell you how it's done we need our dirty coin we need a dish to do the cleaning in we need a source of electricity which is here this is uh, an old phone charger that I had lying around. This particular one is 6 volts, which I think is a, a quite a nice voltage. It's big enough to do the job and small enough not to do a load of damage, as um, a 12 volt one would likely do. Uh, we strip off the plug at the end and we attach crocodile clips. Right, we have one pause and one negative. We also need uh, this, which is a stainless steel spoon. This is going to be our positive connection, and you're just going to sort of hang about in there. Uh, the coin will be our negative connection, and we will see what happens, world. I'm just going to set all this up, and I will be back in a few minutes. Go and have a cup of tea. Okay, well, we are back and we are ready for action. Uh, I've put into here some hot water and a good tablespoon of ordinary table salt just to give it better conductivity. I shall connect the positive clip to our spoon and drop that in. Over there, out of the way. I shall take our negative lead, which I shall connect to our coin and I will drop that in there out of the way we can't have the two touching I will take our supply and I will plug it in and immediately we can see bubbles forming on the negative electrode so we people are in business. I could do with something to weigh that down. Okay. Now we're in business. All we're going to do now, people, is leave it to its own devices for a wee while. And uh, we'll come back later and see what happens. We're going to give it uh, 15 minutes. And then we'll see where we are. Come back when you've had a cup of tea, world. Okay, well, 15 minutes has passed, and uh, our solution looking extremely murky. What's going on here? Oh, I can see an improvement in our world. I can see a definite, definite improvement there. What do you think, world? Can you see an improvement? I think we'll stick it back in and uh, continue. Just same as that point there, so we get a clean point. Put that in there, and we shall give it another 15 minutes and see where we get will. Go and have another cup of tea, and I'll see you when I have. Okay, well, we're back. Another 15 minutes has passed. And, God, this is thick, getting like mud. We'll slish about and see what we've got here. Oh, that's come a long way, people. That has come a long, long way. But do you know what? It's not copper coloured at all. It looks more silvery, if anything. We just 
Take that off. I'm just going to wash it under the tap, people. Okay, let's see what we can see. Right, let's have a look, people. Oh, yes. I'm pleased with that, people. Look at that, people. What do you think? Hmm? You remember what it was like when we started? That has come a long way. In fact, that has come so far, I'm going to leave it at that. And I will call this experiment one complete success. How to clean coins using ele electrolysis and without doing damage. Thank you for watching, world. Come back another day for another little treat. Hello world, well I decided to give it another half hour, so we're now going to have a fine look. Oh, would you look at that world, would you look at that. Hmm? Is that not bad, or is that not bad, can I get that in focus for you? That is not bad, I'm going to give that a bit of a scrub. And we'll see what it looks like clean world. There we go. Give a bit of a snubby. And there we are, world. That, I would say, is the finished product. It's our best in focus. Considering what we started with, I think that that is not half bad. Now, I will truly call this experiment a success. Thank you for watching, world. Come back another day for something else. Who knows what?